Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. It's Rylan Lindley over here with Field Deal Boats, and today we're going to be going over this 2021 Yamaha SX195. And so a lot of people, you know, kind of don't know a whole lot about the 19-foot Yamaha line, and so just kind of some a few quick indicators, right? So the SX is really going to mean that it's going to have a bimmy top instead of a tower, and it's going to have that co-captain's chair instead of the bench seat. Um, you may have also seen the AR-195s, which will give you the actual water sports tower and that bench seat instead of this co-captain's chair. Um, you'll also see that there is an SX-190 and an SX-195. Um, so this is the 195, and the 195 is the same size as the 190s. The 195 is going to give you greater horsepower, which is going to be the biggest difference between those boats. So, you're going from uh, a 190, which has a naturally aspirated 180 horsepower single motor, to a 195, which is giving you a supercharged 250 horsepower motor. So the SX195 is every bit of a 50 mile an hour boat. Um, I really recommend it for people who are going to load up six to eight people and still want to go out and do water sports. So that extra horsepower, the supercharger really helps with getting you out of the hole shot, getting people up on skis, wakeboards, and, and obviously having fun on the inner tube. So come on back to the back of the boat, show you a few quick things. So not only does the 195 give you more horsepower, but it's also more trim, right? So you're going to get some nicer accents to the boat. You get both levels of sea deck right here on the swim platform. You're going to notice some stainless steel accents inside the boat. Um, before we hop in, I do want to touch on uh, a quick thing on the back. So as y'all may know, Yamaha did add the, the integrated keel to their boat. So it's a single engine motor. and used to you had to rely on sole jet propulsion for any type of steering or anything like that now they have added this paddle that's right below the jet nozzle that's going to help so much with with tracking you know when you're on plane if you go into a turn you have something to actually bite the water um, or if you're putting the boat back on the trailer or you're parking it in your boat slip or anything like that at low speeds that helps a lot with maneuverability um, so kudos to you Yamaha that's awesome As we're walking in, you'll know that Yamaha is famous for the clean out port. So open this up, um, get into your clean out port if you ever were to get a wake rope sucked in. I do have a separate video on that explaining what that is and the importance of it if y'all want to check that out. But let's go ahead and climb into the boat. All right, so you'll notice for a 19 foot boat, Yamaha has one of the biggest interior spaces inside. And one of the reasons for it is because they are a jet boat, right? Um, jet boat motors have a much lower profile to them than stern drives. And so that really gives Yamaha the ability to open up a lot of interior space. They've also made their 19 footers a little bit more wider from previous year models. So they're now going up to an eight foot two inch beam, um, which really just opens up so much interior space. And I'll even tell a lot of people going into the bow, a 19 foot boat where as an adult, I'm six foot tall, being able to sit right here with another male or a person just the size and not knock knees is pretty impressive. And then just to kind of double up on that, the 195s do give you the bow filler cushions. So right here in the, in the front, you'll have those two cushions that fill in and make that a full sun pad for you to just come and lay out in. And then I do want to show y'all beautiful dash you will have the bolster seat right here if you want to sit up a little bit taller on the boat you will have the tilt steering um, this chair will swivel all the way around or go back and forth so you can really find the most comfortable spot for you um, so great ergonomics on the boat you'll have the cell phone holder that Yamaha gives you and so I'll put my cell phone right there um, you can put on a map card or you can Bluetooth to your stereo system You'll have all of your inputs right here, so that can just you know plug right into your phone, have it charging the whole time, and then running all your other boat diagnostics from the Connect screen. And so guys, this is such an awesome boat. I can't think of a better 19 foot boat out there. So if y'all have any questions, please reach out to me, rlindley at fieldillboats.com. Um, we are having a boat week coming up, so please ask about that. And look forward so much to meeting you guys. Have a wonderful day.